knowing where scales come from is going to help us figure out our chords and also understanding key, key centers better. So what we have is we have a formula to build our first major scale. And what we do is we can start at any note, plug in this formula, and then that's going to be how we get our major scales. I'm using C as my example first. And the formula is whole, whole, half, whole, 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 half. So that's whole steps and half steps. So I'm going to start from C, whole, step, whole, half, whole, 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 half. To find other scales, we're going to be referring to our major scale as 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and then 8, or 1 again. So uh, to find like a, uh, our mi a minor scale, it would be 1, 2, flat 3, 4, 5, flat 6, flat 7, there would be our uh, C natural minor scale. If we were to do a uh, mixolydian, it'd be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, flat 7, back to 1. Dorian would be 1, 2, flat 3, 4, 5, 6, flat 7, back to 1. So we could see that all of our scales that we're building are going to be just moving around a couple notes from our home base, the major scale. This works on any note. So if I were to go to G, whole, whole, half, whole, 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 half. This is also part of the reason why our, our scale patterns work anywhere. There's my G major scale. If I were to go to C major scale, same pattern because the sequence of notes, the steps between them all stay the same. Mm -hmm.